whoever tells you don't be afraid is just preaching the theory they don't believe in. Don't be afraid? Really? Afraid of what? Because how can you not be afraid of losing yourself? Of losing sight of what once was the real you, for instance. Your inner child, your sparkle, your philosophy, your core. How can you not be afraid of waking up one morning not remembering your mission in life? Afraid of looking back in a moment and realizing how many moments you've lost because you were not afraid and now you are in someone else's path. Be afraid, I say. Be very afraid of yourself because it wouldn't be enough this physical lifetime to get surprised by what you don't know about you. The point of life is discovering what is the real you and not just discovering more about you. Which one is the path you've chosen and not how many paths you could walk in. Don't be afraid is a beautiful way to say walk blindly and you'll arrive there. Be afraid, human. Because what you carry inside is not only a heavenly God, but also the most dark and dangerous demon of all, your mind. Be afraid of that. For what enters your mind should come out again in a way or another, and if you're not afraid of that, every little moment is a decision making for who we are. For what we believe and stand for and for what we hide under the umbrella of non-acceptance. Be afraid so you don't have to be regretful. Be afraid so you don't have to be sorry. And stop pressuring yourself to believe in don't be afraid and you'll arrive there. It's totally fine to be afraid of losing what is important for you just because you are not afraid.